My friend, when you spend 10 minutes in meditation, it can drastically change your day for the better. I invite you right now to do just that. One of the most beautiful places in our Bible is in Numbers, verse 6, 24 through 26. The Lord bless and keep you. The Lord make God's face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift up God's countenance upon you and give you peace. We join our prayers today with ministries of every faith around the world that are praying these words from our Bible. The Christ within you is your hope of glory. May the Christ infill our hearts and our minds right now as we enter our time of meditation. In quiet communion with God, peace and calm now sweep over you. You are hushed in the awareness of your available help from God. In the silence of prayer we rest and prepare. You relax. You let go. In your mind's eye, you see a peaceful place, perhaps a green meadow with a quiet stream. Here, in this place, you are safe. Here, you feel the presence of God within and all around you. You let go of thoughts of the day, for this is your time to be alone with God. As you release your concerns, you set them aside and you allow the quiet stream to carry away every one of your cares. You are utterly relaxed as you affirm these words. God fills my world now with peace. With a peaceful heart, you turn your thoughts to guidance. As the light of the sun dispels the darkness of the night, the light of the Christ shines within your mind and your heart, dispelling any doubt. It shines brightly to guide you on the path of God's life. The road that you choose, no matter how narrow or winding it may seem, is illumined by the light of Christ. You take this comforting thought and you let it settle deep within. The Christ presence is with you, within you, now. Whatever decisions that you have to make, you make these with ease and with confidence, for you're filled with the light of Christ. You recognize the Christ light within yourself and within each person as your heart and mind pray now for God's guidance. God is your counsel directing you now in the silence of prayer in all that you do. 
you accept this now in the silence of prayer. You shall be like a watered garden, the stream in your quiet place is a healing stream. As you step into its current, it cleanses, it purifies, it revitalizes you with energy that is strong and new. You accept this now. The healing stream of life is flowing around you and cursing through you. <clears throat> cleansing everything. You feel this as it heals your body and soothes your mind in the silence of prayer. God says, I will extend prosperity to you like a river. You sit in your quiet place among the green grass that grows by the stream. The stream nourishes your soul and provides all that the lush grass needs. Like this stream, God is a river of prosperity that brings to you only good. First, as divine ideas guiding you, and then opportunities to use them. Your mind is still, your heart is open, and like the soil, and the grass along the water's edge. You're nourished and you're fed by God as the river of God's prosperity flows in and through you. It brings a continual abundance of every good thing to you. Your life is enriched as you pray our prayer for prosperity. God now opens my mind and my heart to God's full abundance. How wonderful. How incredibly wonderful and grateful we are to know that this oasis, this quiet place is within us eternally. Whenever we need guidance, whenever we seek healing, whenever we need supply, we prepare for our day now from this quiet place and we give thanks for the presence of God and all that it means to us. I invite you to come back to this time and place and know that in Jesus Christ's name we seal this prayer as so. Amen.